The Custard Factory is the creative hub of Birmingham, and rather than wearing its heart on its sleeve, it wears it on its walls. Colour, characters and creatives have all left their mark here on the street art. From the infamous Benny Gray to the Bin Monsters, there's no shortage of interesting things to see. Quite recently there's been um, an event called Sea of Colours, and that's really yeah, promoted a lot of street art around the area. I can't really single out one piece, but I look at the one just there, which is by um, Dank, so I look at that quite a lot. I really like that one. Personally, why I'm here is because I wanted to be around creative people. In a weird way, this part of Birmingham, Digba, doesn't feel like Birmingham to me. I'm feeling positive about being around here and looking for more like-minded people to open up shops, to create art, for us to come together as a community and kind of push the boundaries of this area. I think it's about everyone coming together for the love of being creative and really kind of putting our mark down here. What I like the most is the fact that you've got so much variation and it's very character driven rather than the old school sort of words and I think that encourages all age groups to come into graffiti then from different backgrounds as well. It's just awesome. It just brings so much colour to such a black and white city. Certainly the big mural that you can see to my right done by Nuzo who does the writing and then Gen 48. Um, they're my favourite because it looks like it's almost painted with oil paints. There's so many little things that you have to really look for and like these ones just under here. Like if you didn't, if you weren't stood here talking to me right now I probably wouldn't look at them but they're awesome and they're, they're just so talented as well which is so cool. 